Hey everybody, so in the last video we looked at this, which was Dursan's design for the uh, flat wind turbine, and we tried it in the flat wind turbine condition. At the end of that video I said that I wanted to look at the Darwin, which is always on my mind. For those who don't know about it, and those who've forgotten, here's one from the vaults. This is the Darwin wind turbine, and we did this on a PC fan so we could get a result from it and test that result against not having the Darwin, and we got a massive improvement. And of course, since we've done this, there's been a couple of people in the UK, one Scarborough Council, have put up Darwin wind turbines in the town. So the idea is actually really quite sound, which I'm really pleased about. When I was looking at that and looking at the uh, leaf shed that Durson did, it struck me that we could combine those two, but there were too many leaves. So I've plucked a whole load out. There were 24 in total, if you remember, and there's only eight left. So I've plucked out two out of every three. And the idea would be that a larger Darwin would go over that, and of course it would direct the airflow down. Now when I look at that, it looks very much like, to me, this shape here, like the blade of an ordinary turbine. It's got that aerodynamic curved shape. So I've put them out and I'm thinking that that will do quite a job if the air is coming from the top. So what we're going to do is we're going to test whether that works or not. Whoa, 9 volts. Awesome. 12 volts. Really? 14, 15, 16, <laughs> 17, 18. Zoink. Oh, well, that's a bit impressive. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it continue to spin. <laughs> I'll just keep going and going. Wow. Okay, that worked really, really well. That was a 3.4 metre wind speed from that fan that I was holding, blowing directly on it. So that works amazingly if the air is coming down and of course that's exactly what we want for the Darwin and remember we're incorporating those other two ideas generation on the rim and magnetic levitation to get this to work really well so we tested that looks really great we probably need to look a little more at the aerodynamics of this blade combine it with the, the Darwin I think we're on a winner we're actually getting to where I want to be I hope you enjoyed the series of videos. Thank you very much for watching. And please do remember to like and subscribe.